Hey, Curious! In 2005, premiered the first episode of one of the best sitcoms ever made by Earthlings, but that for some reason is not as famous as many others. Why is it so hard to believe that I have a date with a perfectly nice normal girl? More than 17 years after the first episode, how is the cast of the series? Well, today we will discover that and maybe a little more about them. So, without further ado... That's two dollars on fire! That's 49 cents of spilt milk dripping all over my table. Somebody gonna drink this milk. Our beloved Julius was played by our even more beloved Jerry Cruz, who is an actor but also a former football linebacker. After Everybody Has Chris, his most famous work was in Brooklyn Nine-Nine as Terry Jeffers. He currently holds America's Got Talent. Who are you hollering at? Hold my calls. Hold your own damn call. I do not need this. My man has two jobs. Tishina Arnold plays the fun and angry Rochelle. After Everybody Hates Chris, she appeared in another comedy series called Happily Divorced. In her latest work on the air since 2018, she stars in the comedy The Neighborhood as Tina Butler. You don't have a hockey jersey. No, I don't. No. Yeah. Why? Give it to me. Give it to me. Make me. Whoa! I hold on. Jaquan Richmond, also known for his music career as T Rich, played Chris Young brother Drew. He also played TJ in General Hospital, for which he won three daytime Emmy nominations for Outstanding Young Actor in a Drama Series. He subsequently starred in The Unsettling and Boomerang. Gotta go to the bank. Since Doc didn't leave the store during business hours, he never got to go to the bank. I never knew where he kept his money. That'll be a deposit. That mattress was his wallet. Doc, Chris Boss at the Neighborhood Grocery Store is played by Antonio Fargas. After Everybody Hates Chris, he returned to his small roles, appearing in shows such as House of Lies, Man and Wife, and Captain Sharif. He keeps acting and his next move, called One Year Off, he still doesn't have a release date. Dude, you are so in there! Anytime I did anything involving a girl, Greg thought I was in there. Chris, can I borrow a pencil? Dude, you are so in there. Vincent Martella played Greg. After the series, his most famous role was voicing Phineas in the Disney animated series Phineas and Ferb. He also appeared on The Walking Dead and played Bradley in the miniseries Milo Murphy's Law. His last movie is called Shallow Water and probably will be released in 2023. That the right leather jacket would have turned me from this guy into this guy. Chris. That leather jacket is cool. Let's hang out. As soon as I'm finished posing. Tyler James Williams became famous for playing the role of Chris. The actor continued his career after everybody hates Chris and played roles like Lionel in the movie Dear White People and Star in the movie The Wedding Year. His most recent role is as Gregory, a teacher on the sitcom Abbott Elementary. Right then, I'll help you out. Oh, this is great. Thanks. <gasps> now give me some skin. I've always wanted to do that. <laughs> Run before she makes you tap dance. Chris' teacher, Miss Morello, is played by Jacqueline Mazzarella. With the end of Everybody Hates Chris, she continued her career with small characters and appearances in series such as Fresh Off the Boat, Jane the Virgin, and The Morning Show. Her last movie was the truly Paradise Cove in 2021. Ah, he's choking! Help him! Hold on! There's nothing we can do! But he's still choking! Not anymore. Tragic. Ernest Thomas plays the womanizer Mr. Romer, tenant of Chris family and owner of a funeral home. After the series, Thomas returned to guest appearance in series and movies like Vip and The Lords of Salem. His most prominent role was in the comedy Funny People with Adam Sandler and Seth Rogen. Hey! Little dude from across the street. Let me hold a dolly. 
Hey, Mac, I'll talk to you for a minute. Yeah. Later on. Known for taking a dollar from Chris every time he saw him, Jerome is played by the rapper Kevonte Jackson. Also known as K. Jackson, he continued to make appearances in series like Mad Men and Dear White People. His last acting job was as the flagman in the comedy Blunt News. You know what? I don't need this mess. My father has two jobs. Deja vu! Imani Hakim played Tonya, Chris's younger sister. She is also known for playing Olympic gold medalist Gabby Douglas in the award-winning film The Gabby Douglas Story. Her most recent job was the role of Dana in the Apple TV Plus comedy series Mythic Quest. Her next movie will be a drama called 40. Chris, what are you doing? These are for you. Boy, you're so crazy. I thought about being shivering. Boy, you're so crazy. Queen's love interest Tasha is played by Paige Hurd. After the series, she also appeared in some music videos such as Justin Bieber's Never Let It Go. Furthermore, she has also been in projects like action series Hawaii Five-O and the drama The Oval. Her most recent work is as Lauren in the Power Book Two Ghosts series. Travis Flower, the actor who plays Joey Caruso, has not acted professionally since 2015 when he made a cameo in the movie Little Boy. What can I get you? I would talk to Sunday. Hey, I ain't talking to you, Nip. Sadly, actor and comedian Rick Harris passed away in 2016, age 54, from a heart attack. His last acting job was in the movie The Workout Room. Ricky Harris? What's up, man? We got the berry, berry, pass the berry, berry. I got you. Hey, I've been looking all over for you, ain't it? Good luck. Well, all these remind us of good times watching Everybody Hates Chris. And another thing we need to remind you of is to like and subscribe here so that this video reaches other planets that don't know one of the best sitcoms ever made. And once again, it's time to say goodbye before the Nigerian military forces finds where I'm hiding. See you in the next video. Over and out.